Okay. Welcome everybody to the Power of Veto ceremony. We competed in a competition called Casino at the Boardwalk, where the two nominees and the three randomly selected veto players are in a betting war. Whoever bet the lowest within a given round was penalized by being given a strike, and whoever bid the most, it was too ballsy, um, would lose that money into their bank account. And uh, by a narrow last minute overbid, uh, Marvin was the one who emerged victorious and is currently the holder of the power of veto. Marvin, you either had the choice to abstain, leaving Brian and Jazzy up on the block, or choose to use it on one of the nominees, therefore forcing Keaton, the current HOH, to name a replacement nominee. So, Marvin, the floor is yours. So, this is what, week four. And the last three vetoes have not been used whatsoever. And honestly, I think that's kind of boring. I will say that the very least. Um, I will be using it. And... I obviously had conversations and I had to think as to what would be best for my game moving forward. I know this will end up having certain individuals not like me because of the decision that I'm about to make. And I'm perfectly fine with it. It's big brother. It's just a game. And at the end of the day, I'm the one that's going to have to deal with the consequences, not anybody else. So, Keaton is um, chaotic, to say the least. And why not continue the week with being chaotic? And I know I did tell one individual that I would be using the veto on them, but I am going to be using the veto on Brian. All right, then with uh, Marvin's decision, Brian has been removed off the block. Kean, as the current head of household, it is their responsibility to name a replacement nominee to replace Brian to sit next to Jazzy up on the block. And uh, Nick has come to a decision. Their renom is Nick. That means that the final nominations are Nick and Jazzy. You guys will have until tomorrow. We'll be sending up a poll. We'll be announcing whoever votes, whichever time is voted in the majority. That will be the time of not only the eviction, but the deadline for pre-votes in the event that you can't attend the eviction ceremony will be due. Again, the final nominees are Nick and Jazzy for Brian, Marvin, and the rest of the nominee, the rest of the players who have survived week four. Congratulations on week four, surviving week four. Wow. But uh, Nick and Jazzy, you guys are going to have to wait a little bit to see if you guys survive as well. Um, best of luck to both nominees and best of luck to everybody else. Well, I guess the game is on, guys. <laughs> Thank you, Jacob, so, you we slip there. I the, would uh, say so. <laughs> who is shocked that Keaton nominated me once again? I am. I think we all are. I was told a different name. <laughs> That's I was told a different Same. name, too. Marvin, Same. I think right when I... Wait, when you won veto, that's why I wanted to win veto. Keaton's a nasty snake and he does shit like that all the time. Well, I guess Keaton wanted to keep the theme going with chaos. Yeah. Well, if that is all, I'm going to go stop the recording unless anybody has anything else to say.